at Sassy's dinner, you were asked a question about the war and you answered it from a financial perspective. The answer was interesting, but I didn't think it was exactly on point. Are you prepared for serious debate on the national defense and foreign affairs? Will you have advisors on these or other non-financial issues? I'm prepared to debate it. You know, I think that, you know, the, the cost of the wars is important. Um, and, you know, if we're broke, obviously we can't afford to defend ourselves. So I think it's very important that we understand that. I mean, the Soviet Union fell, not because they didn't have a strong military, but because they couldn't afford uh, to finance it anymore. And we've got troops all around the world, and our ability to supply these troops and to, uh, you know, uh, mobilize them and to pay them is the going is because the Japanese and the Chinese, uh, you know, and the rest of the world loans us the money and sends us the supplies. And, and so we're very vulnerable from that position. Uh, but sure, I'd have a debate beyond on the non-financial aspects of what the role of the Defense Department would be and, and what I think is wrong there uh, with respect to, you know, how I think, you know, that it would be better for the federal government to go about uh, performing that function, which is its main function, the sole you know, most important function of the federal government is national defense. That's the only reason the founding fathers gave them the ability to tax. They, they weren't even going to have it. And the arguments were that, well, what about wars? If, we, if the government can't tax, how is it going to defend us? And that's, so that's why they got the power to tax. So, um, you know, I think it's a very important function. It is the primary function of, of the federal government. But, yeah, I have differences of opinion uh, between how, how we should be defending this country.